David, performances have been very good of late. So how do you go about now turning performances into points? This is what we now have to do and this is our job where we have to be focused on. I said this more often and I, I'm a strong believer and I will always be that if you perform consistently on the highest level, points, wins, goals will come. And this is exactly what we, what we have to be focused on, that we do what we've done in the past, performance-wise, uh, the spirit which you've seen, which you felt, uh, which you can feel in the group, the attitude, uh, the desire, the passion. And then, as I said, if you are able to do this consistently, and uh, the players have done it now for a longer period, more consistently, we only have to do it more often, and the results will come, and this is where we are focused on. Javi Grazia, the Watford boss, said yesterday that this is the, the most difficult game that his side could have this weekend. Jürgen was very complimentary last week as well. Does it speak volumes of the way your side are performing when you get these comments about performances? Yeah, first of all, I think uh, our opponents, managers, uh, they can judge games and results as well. And I think it isn't a surprise. So I, I will not sit here and tell you any lies. I think this makes no sense. If the truth is we perform now in recent weeks consistently on a very high level without enough goals, without enough points, I will tell you. If it isn't the case, I will tell you as well. And if I will tell it to you, usually the opponents' managers, because uh, they are altogether very intelligent and very smart, they, they, they know how football works, they see it as well, and then if they get asked, maybe they, they, they give you the right answer as well, and this is what they have done, so that isn't a surprise to me. But we are not happy, so we like to have more. We are, if you like, greedy to now get as quick as we can something on the board because this is why we do this we all together know it's a result driven business that it is but as i said at first you have to perform consistently on a very high level and then you deserve something and this is where we are focused you won home and away against Watford last season does that give you a lot of belief does it give you a possible <laughs> psychological edge no, this is this was last season. I, I I'm very impressed what Javier is doing with uh, Watford in this season. Uh, they they look very solid, very very good organized, um, very difficult to break down. They have everything. They have power. They have speed. It's a, it's a it's a it's opponent which deserved to have the points on the board which they have. There was not one lucky point which they have so far from my point of view. And this only shows how good they are. But we go there and try tomorrow to get a positive result. This is our aim. This is what we will do, which opponent we will ever face. And this was in the past. This was the same last week against Liverpool, the week before against Burnley, home or away. We try to play our football, we try to bring our strength on the grass, we try to perform on the highest level and of course we try to score and to win as well. Some of the things which we tried worked <laughs> and we got a reward, some not, uh, but this will not stop, uh, even if we now play against a very good Watford side. You've come through a, a tough set of fixtures, you've got some fixtures coming up that don't look quite as difficult on paper. so. Will the next four or five games be season defining? This is again uh, exactly the problem. On paper, <laughs> they don't look as quite difficult, but they are. All of them, all games in the Premier League are difficult. Yes, we had a difficult fixture start. Uh, now we have uh, a next block of games in front of us. You have to try to perform and collect points in every single game, and this is what we have done. I think we all together we still have enough confidence, uh, for sure enough bravery, we've seen this in recent games, to try our best. Uh, the mood is 
very very positive if you see where we are how many points we have it could be totally different but it isn't and this is one of the strengths and one of the characters uh, which this group has and this is exactly what i like to do to push this uh, to keep this uh, this this atmosphere in our dressing room and to make sure that you can see it on the pitch and that you get the support from the stands as well this is how we work since day one and uh, this is what we will continue.